LaserJet External Finisher Hole Punch Accessory Unboxing and Setup Y1G10A, Y1G11A, Y1G12A This video shows how to install and set up the HP LaserJet Hole Punch Accessory on the HP LaserJet Managed External Finisher. First, press the power button to turn off the printer. Then, disconnect the power cord from the printer and the wall outlet. Open the front door. Pull out the locking rail until it stops. Slide the finisher away from the printer. Disconnect any cables connected to the printer. Pry the cover out of the punch waste bin opening. Install the punch waste bin label. Then insert the punch waste bin. Close the front door. Remove the two screws that secure the punch unit access panel on the rear of the finisher. Remove the punch unit access panel. Remove the two screws that secure the dummy punch unit. Remove the dummy punch unit. Note, save the dummy punch unit in case the hole punch fails. It must be reinstalled for the finisher to operate properly without a hole punch installed. Carefully slide the punch unit into the finisher. Align the mounting bracket at the rear. Install the screw that secures the punch unit to the finisher. Then, insert the punch unit cable into the connector. Replace the punch unit access panel. Replace the two screws that secure the punch unit access panel on the rear of the finisher. Position the finisher near the left side of the printer and then connect two cables. Open the finisher front door. Pull out the locking rail until it stops. Align the brackets on the printer to the holes on the finisher and then roll the finisher against the printer. Push in the locking rail. Close the front door. Plug the power cord into a wall outlet. The hole punch accessory and printer are now ready for use. Click the Playlists tab in YouTube to find HP videos in other languages. And search our channel to find official HP support videos.